it do, what it do, what it do. It's your boy Badger. And it's Maha. And today we are watching yet again another Skibbity Toilet video. We, we are already at, know the deal. We are at Skibbity Toilet 59. 59. More, More than, than 100, 100 episodes. Episode. <laughs> yeah, we are Skibbity Toilet 59, man. We almost to 60. Hey, this man's gonna hit over like 100 episodes, which is crazy. I don't know, it might end at 100, but this is kind of his main thing, so I don't know if he's gonna stop or not. It's, it's been a journey, right? Yeah. It's been like three months of watching it's this. It's been an emotional journey. Like, I still wanna know. Is Plunger Man alive? True, I wanna know that too. And we might figure out in Skibbity Toilet 59, so. Let's stop all this talking and get to the verse of the day. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Verse of the day is Romans 10, 9. And it says, if you declare with your mouth, Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. Praise be. Amen to that. They violated him. Speaker people. The speaker people. We haven't seen them in a bit. He came to find his people. He's dancing again. They've taken over. Son of a <laughs> Yo, so basically it looks like they went to go find speaker, uh, Titan speakers people, and they got them and they're released from the chains and bondage of the skibbity toilet people. That was, that was a good one, man. That was. I wonder what's gonna like come out of all this though. Like things are just looking too good right now. Too good. And you know when things look too good, there's always something bad that happens. Major plot twist. So I don't know, man. Let's let's. Did you see the um, agent in any of that? I didn't notice anything. Nah, but... I doubt it. But I didn't see no skivity. I mean, agent saved his life. This is the first time we've seen this dang toilet. They got rocket launchers on this man. He got a helmet. He got claws. They're doing too much. They do all this for this man to still get That's jacked up. All that to still get messed up. It don't make any sense. No sense. Look, like, oh dang. Bruh. My man did he a rolled. roll. Yeah. He rolled on, bruh. Dirty. That was mad disrespectful. That was. He that took was. his gun. He put it in his mouth. Like he opened it wide, stuck it in, and released. <laughs> but what comes next is even more disrespectful. Bro, what? They, 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 they did him dirty. Stuck all that junk in his mouth. Hey, yo. <laughs> He's like, my people, I've come to save you. I, I don't even know where they were in the beginning. I don't know actually. either. I don't even know if they were actually being held captive. It looks like it though, like how he- Look at that man dancing. <laughs> dancing. Man, y'all already know the usual, so we gotta see what was all the secrets and Easter eggs in episode 59. And you already know, we tried to go to ISO toilet, but he ain't drop it. So, you know, we had to go to the backup elite cameraman. Shout out to the cameraman for coming up with this analysis, man. So let's see what's all the stuff in this last episode. Elite cameraman here. 
Episode 59 was released yesterday and it was filled with action. The speakerman finally came back. We saw the secret agent again, but without the green glow this time, we saw the scabitty toilets teleport again, just like the skull toilet the in episode heck? 55 and a lot more. I'll cover all these I secrets and Easter the eggs in episode 59 that you might have missed or didn't notice. Anyways, here we go. We start the episode seeing a battlefield where both sides seem to be losing and no one has the upper hand. Mm. This place is most likely still in London or in the UK like the last episode. As I you can see, that. there are both cameramen and mm -hmm. Skibidi toilet bodies around this place lying dead on the ground. I don't know how long the war has been going on in this place, but it seems like both sides have been struggling and no support for neither side has reached the place yet, but as you know, this is about to change. After we start running towards the Skibidi in front of us, we jump on its back to save the cameraman and flush the Skibidi toilet. Afterwards, we see the Skibidi toilet reacting to the cameraman getting <laughs> on top of the Skibidi toilet. It seems like even though they can't do much about it, their reflexes seems to have improved over the course of the war. And mm. as you can see, this Skibidi toilet literally has no upgrades and doesn't even have a gray toilet. It's been a while from my recollection since we have seen one of these toilets. I might be wrong about this, but it might be that the cameraman and the toilets here have been fighting for a long time. When you think about it, the cameraman here doesn't have stun guns too, so they should have been dispatched at least before episode 53. This begs the question, why was there no support for this place all this time? Anyways, in the first scene we also get to see the secret agent again. But this time he doesn't have his green glow like the last two times. Where are you seeing Even him? though I'm not sure, I feel like this kind of confirms oh! my theory about the green glow. As you can see clearly, he is hiding behind a car in this episode, How we and he is that. not just out in I the open. That. We better see the secret agent take action soon. He literally has been appearing in almost every episode and has literally. been watching over the battle in literally every continent. Also, right after we save the cameraman from the Skibidi toilet, if we look back at the car, the oh, secret agent is nowhere gone. to be seen. He may have guessed what was about to happen and left the place or went to a rooftop where he can watch the battle better. This also gives me a new idea. What if one of the powers the secret agent possesses is foresight? Maybe he can see slightly into the future or guess what's going to happen and act accordingly. Or he's controlling it all. I think he's in control of all this. After this, the cameraman that we saved gives us a thumbs up. But the second he gives his thumbs up, we are shaken by a huge explosion and sounds. The second we turn to our right, we can clearly see that it's a new giant skibidi toilet. But something is strange because there was no one there before and it's kind of hard for a skibidi toilet that large to come there unnoticed and we can see the black smoke, which we normally see whenever the TV race teleports. Mm. These skibidi toilets literally appear out of thin air, just like the skull skibidi toilet in episode 55. The real question here is, did they replicate the TV man tech or is there a mm. traitor in the TV race? If there actually is a traitor among the TV race, I don't think they'll take that lightly. The TV man, as you know, can get angry very fast and they don't seem like the type that forgives people. As the black smoke disappears, we can see the new Skibidi toilet filled with tools. It seems like has knockoff versions of G-Man Skibidi toilet's laser guns. He also has two claws under them, probably for protecting himself up close. Also different from other Skibidi toilet, he has tank wheels under him. I have no idea why, since Skibidi Toilet can move freely normally. Maybe it mm -hmm. is to make him move faster, but I don't know. It seems like this Skibidi Toilet is supposed to resemble a tank because he also has a helmet and some rockets behind him. We also see two helicopter Skibidi Toilets next to him, but their happiness doesn't last long because the helicopter Skibidi Toilets suddenly get shot, and when the camera pans to the left, we see the Titans flying together Woo! towards the battlefield. Yes, sir. Titan Speakerman takes the lead and does some cool movements and kills the new tank Skibidi Toilet pretty easily. With this, a new plane Skibidi ah. Toilet with red eyes comes into the battlefield, shooting the Titan Speakerman. But as we know by now, these attacks are useless against him. Useless. Yes. Titan Speakerman decides to take him on and flies on him, and after we see <sighs> the Titan Speakerman stuffing the tank Skibidi Toilet's guns inside his mouth, opening a huge hole and kicking him towards the building to make him explode. My guess is to why he did this would be that. They don't want mm. the Skibidi toilets using salvaging the guns back and using them again. The most important stuff in this episode happens right after this point. 
Also note that this was the end of season 19 because that'll be important later on. We see the Titan speaker man looking so cool while riding the plane skibidi <laughs> toilet while coming down. He jumps down and gets a thumbs up from the Titan cameraman, probably meaning that he has done a good job and redeemed himself from his bad actions while he was infected. After this, we get one of the most awaited things happen, the comeback of speakerman. Mm -hmm. We still don't know where they were or how many of them are still alive after all this time, but it seems like they were hiding all along, most likely to be safe from the infected Titan uh... speaker man. And without a commander like him, they most likely didn't know what to do. We see True. a lot of speakermen come to the scene, and after that, we see the Titans dabbing with a bang to celebrate. This was honestly a great way to end one of the best seasons so far, but things are probably about to get more complicated. Big facts. Lately, the Alliance have been coming on top all the time, and yeah. Skibidi Toilets have been trying hard, but they keep losing almost every season. They lost New York. They lost Dubai, and now London has been recaptured. I didn't even know I'd, they went all these places. I I didn't know they were in I all these countries. I thought it was countries. the same city. Yeah. I thought it was Charlotte. <laughs> That's what I thought. I thought, this is news to me. I thought they was in Louisiana. <laughs> I ain't know they was in all these places, Dubai, and all right. It seems like the Alliance is on a win streak. Literally every powerful entity has been killed or Facts. damaged. What do you think they are going to do? My guess is that... We are about to see some crazy upgrades from mm -hmm. the Skibidi Toilet side. Facts. I really do think that the comeback of G-Man Skibidi Toilet will be huge next time. Yeah. He didn't seem like he was just mad in episode 57. It seemed like his murder intent was off the charts before he escaped. He was damaged and humiliated. There is no <laughs> way he lets that slide. Either the next season or the season after that, I think the Skibidi Toilets are going to start taking the lead again in some way. What do you think is going to happen in the next season? <laughs> And we still have the case of the plunger cameraman, and we'll be waiting for him to come back. Facts. Hopefully we get to see him soon, instead of waiting about 20 episodes or so. <laughs> if you caught any secrets that I didn't mention, let me know in the comments. That was a good episode, good way to end the season, but he's right. They've been winning all season. Skivvy Toilet's been getting their butt handed to him. It's too so, easy. Yeah, so the switch up is about to come, because as you can see, G-Man head or whatever. What's his G-Mod? G-Mod guy, whatever, big skibbity toilet. He has been getting beat the freak up and he is peed off. So the scientist is about to upgrade this man to the max and someone's about to get a whooping. I don't know if it's Titan cameraman or Titan speak speaker man, but someone about to get the hands from somebody. I don't know, but you know who's gonna end this all and save us all? Plunger man! It's all gonna come back to him, I'm telling y'all. I'm, I'm predicting it now, I'm putting money on it. It's gonna come back to the small guy. Me too, I agree. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the post notification. Yes sir, and um, yeah, hit us up. Put in the comments what y'all want us to watch and keep us updated with the Skivdy Toilet episode series, man. And thanks for rocking with us. Yes, sir. We almost at 30K. Let's keep pushing, y'all. Let's keep Let's pushing. Go, baby. But yeah, until then, man. AG2G. All glory to God. Peace out. Yeah.